Before combining animations with motion flow, you need to save them to BIP format. Select your biped and in biped section, click save icon. Next, name your file and click save button. Do this to every animation. Create new biped, go to a biped section, click motion flow icon. Next, go to motion flow graph icon. In motion graph, create clip holders as many as you need. Next, right click over each clip holder and load your biped format animation. Next, create transition between each clip. For the next step, we need to use script. Create script, name it, and load animation clips to the script. You do that by clicking once on each clip. Preview your animation and check final results. Quality of your mix depends on quality of your animation. Sometimes you need to make additional adjustments. But before you do that, turn off script and create unified motion. Click on unify motion icon. Deselect a keyframe per frame option if you want to see keyframes that you set up. Next, turn off motion flow mode. Now you can preview combined animation and make adjustment when needed. In my animation, I need to adjust the position of the run cycle. I'll turn on auto key, go to layers, create new layer, select the whole pose, create a key at end of run cycle. Then I go back to the frame where the pipette is under the ground level and I move it up. I repeat this action for the other poses as well. When I finish adjustment, I go back to the layers and collapse them. Again, quality of your mix depends on quality of your animation clips. Thank you.